we are uh, happy uh, that there has been and breath. We we are still sort of disappointed with the timeline of the arrest. Uh, it's taken a great deal of time to uh, issue a warrant for someone who was clearly seen in the video who was identified very early on. Two weeks. That's how long it took for Daniel Borden to be arrested in this investigation. Lee Merritt, the attorney for DeAndre Harris, says there were six people involved in the incident during the Charlottesville protests. One of those police believe is the 18-year-old Borden. He was arrested on Friday and charged with malicious wounding. That's a felony charge in Virginia. Uh, those kind of people are dangerous to the community, so we expect some jail time. We expect for these, these, these crimes to be met with more than a slap on the wrist or a warning. Merritt told me during a one-on-one -on -one interview he believes the incident should be considered a hate crime. And then use violence against a particular race. Uh, if you don't get a hate crime out of that, I don't see any situation where you can get a hate crime. We've checked and so far it's unclear when Borden will be transported back to Charlottesville to face those charges. Merritt says his client hopes to meet the suspects face-to-face -face in court. But one thing that he's not afraid of is to face his attackers uh, and to see them brought to justice.